Hey everyone, Brandon here with your weekly update. So, this week I am still chugging along at Stormlight 5. Um, as of recording this, we are currently at bing, 15%, uh, which puts us at around 200,000 words for the manuscript as a whole, uh, which is more or less what I was expecting. Um, I have had a bit of a slower week this week because I have been working on some small things here and there, um, so sorry about that. But uh, don't worry, we are still on track to finish Stormlight 5 by the deadline. So in other news, um, the Kickstarter that we just launched last week is now once again uh, the number one Kickstarter of all time. Uh, for those of you who missed it, this was the Kickstarter for the Hope of Elantris Leatherbound. Uh, which you can still back. You still have about a month to back that if you are interested in backing that and receiving a copy of that. Um, and speaking of Leatherbounds, um, the Way of Kings Leatherbounds that we just got in from the bindery are unfortunately all sold out once again. Um, they sold out within about seven milliseconds after they came onto the store, unfortunately. So you will have to wait a couple of months if you want to receive one of those. Also this week, um, I co-authored a couple of novels with a good friend of mine uh, earlier today, which we will be releasing as audiobook exclusives as soon as we can get uh, Michael Kramer and Kate Redding to catch up with us. Um, and another thing you might want to be aware of is that we are doing a special giveaway to celebrate reaching 100 million subscribers on YouTube. Um, this is going to be a giveaway of a special $8 million 24 karat gold plated copy of Warbreaker, um, illustrated like a medieval manuscript. So if you are interested in uh, entering that giveaway, um, you can find the link down below. Also, also, um, I wrote another book the other day that is going to be included with the Secret Project uh, Kickstarter. So if you signed up for the Secret Project Kickstarter, you will actually uh, be receiving uh, five books instead of four with that. Um, and in other news, also, uh, we have added Hoyd as a playable character in Fortnite, uh, because why not? Uh, and also the Dragonsteel Minicon has been moved to the largest convention center in the United States, in Chicago, um, because the tickets for the Salt Lake City venue sold out too quickly. Um, I don't actually know why we're still calling it a Minicon. Um, and was that all, or was there something? Oh, oh, of course. Um, Earlier this week, I also wrote The Winds of Winter, um, just in case I ever need to have something prepared um, for that. So that is now taken care of. So yeah, that is basically it for this week. Um, sorry again for the relatively slow week, uh, but I have been working on some movie things that uh, I can't talk about yet. Um, but yeah, other than that, thanks for Thanks for watching and thanks for putting up with me and my crazy books.